Yeah, hi. Um, I'm going to do a, a little demonstration today on uh, CoCreate's 3D Compare Parts functionality. Uh, a really, really useful tool. Uh, there's nothing better than visualizing something. Um, so w what I'm going to do is I'm using this uh, sample part, uh, which I've just called Part 1, uh, as you can see on the screen. And the first thing I'm going to do is copy the part. So just make a direct copy. Uh, of the part. This is our source and it's going to create our new part as part 1.1 as if we're just taking a new revision of it. Okay, So just confirm that to accept. Now you can see in our structure browser we have two different parts. Okay, I'm going to switch part 1 off because what I want to do is make some changes to part 1.1 so we can then run the visual comparison between the two. Okay, uh, I'm going to make some pretty simple changes. The first one uh, I'm just going to select uh, this front face, uh, right click and I want to move 3D okay so I'm just going to move this face out pretty simple and straightforward now these uh, these five holes here uh, what I want to do is I'm going to remove two of these holes okay so I'm going to select one S select the the next let me just zoom in a little bit so I can select it a bit easier uh, right click and I'm just going to cut those faces Okay. Uh, the other thing I'll probably want to do here is I'm just going to modify the radius of this hole. Okay, currently at five. I'm going to change that up to a radius of eight. Okay. So I've made a couple of little changes. The other thing I'm going to do here is I'm going to move this face. Okay, a very very small amount. You know, often changes between parts are quite difficult to find or visualize. So uh, I'm just going to say move 3D. Okay, and I'm going to position this uh, a distance of uh, mm, 0.01. Okay, so it's a very small change. Okay, uh, no, I don't want to auto save now. So, okay, let's just fit to screen. Fit to screen. So here we've got our modified part. So now what I want to do is run a visual comparison between the two. Okay, which is pretty cool. So let's take a look at that. I'm going to go into our part assembly menu too, and you'll see under the checking tools here, we've got a compare parts option. My reference part is part one, and the part I'm checking is part 1.1. Okay, I'm going to ask it to auto align any of the geometry that it can, and we're going to calculate the results. Now before I do that I'm just going to close my structure browser so we get a better visual representation of what we're looking at. Uh, if I then run calculate it's, it's really quite cool. Um, wh what it does is it opens two viewports and puts the two different parts that I'm comparing one in each different viewport and then changes on a color coding basis what is visually uh, what, what sorry which geometry has been modified. Now you'll see that uh, as I as I zoom in we can see that these two holes which are highlighted in the orange color are removed geometry okay so this geometry has been deleted and we can see the uh, the sort of the cyan color uh, is geometry that has been modified so taking this top boss for instance although it has only been modified uh, 0.1 of a millimeter we can actually see that it's been changed which I think is pretty cool. Okay, that's the end of my little demonstration. Thank you very much.